Hey guys, Katrina Sims here back with another episode of Katrina's Life. Okay, so last episode, Katrina had went to work. It was her first day of work. And then she went to a lounge. And then, you know, she ended up doing some things at this club. She met this guy and they got back to her place and, you know, they did some things. And so hopefully, and hopefully... They use protection because, whew, Chile, ain't nothing wrong with having fun by me, sis. You got to calm down a little. I just can't believe that Katrina would just give up her cookies like that. So easy to any guy. I mean, yeah, he was cute and all, but dang, girl, he wasn't all that for you to be giving up them cookies. But, yeah, you just hope um, you use protection. But it's okay because right now she's just giving us little poles. Yeah, serving us looks with this and her little PJs. But yeah, she actually is on birth control. Her um stuff that I ordered off the computer last time, her um birth control and pads and tampons, that stuff came in the mail, so she got that, so now she's on her birth control. And I still can't believe I spent 340 simoleons on the dang stuff. Like, seriously, my man, it was worth it. She got quite a lot in her inventory right now. But actually, some of the stuff wasn't even meant to be for her. Because um, I do want to say this. I did add her parents. And I added some of the other characters from the Katrina series. So you will be seeing a lot of people who you might be familiar with. But I added her parents for sure. Because, you know, like I said, this is a whole separate series. So it has a whole, completely different storyline. So in this series, her parents are not, not dead. But in the Free Play series, they're, they're dead. So I decided to bring them back into this series. So they're alive. So I was playing with her parents. Let me just have her stop posing. I had her parents come visit her so you know, they can get the little relationship up a little. And then I had Titi, her mom, go on the computer and order her some pads and stuff and tampons. And little did I know that that stuff actually came to Katrina's mail box instead of theirs because I guess if you order something from someone else's house they would get your mail instead of you getting your mail but yeah it's kind of stupid but um right now um I have some plans I want her to go to Starbucks in the morning because you know Starbucks got that good wi-fi and I want her to work on her writing skill because I guess she'll progress in her writing skill faster. Who the hell told you to go to sleep? I know you're tired, but I want you to do some painting. But um, I want her to go to Starbucks to get her writing skill up. She's just going to go to Starbucks, you know, bring her laptop with her, and get her writing skill up. And this painting right here, she had actually made, but I'm going to have her to, like, look at it for a little. Girl, what? Who the f what the hell is you mad for? Ain't nobody even making noise. I ain't got no music on or nothing. Sometimes these neighbors just want to be annoying just to piss me off, I believe. Because they just be coming, begging on the door to say, hey, keep the noise down, even though I ain't been playing no damn music. Like, look, the damn radio, the stereo right here, speaker not even on. So how the hell? But um, she's just going to inspire this painting, look at it. But I was hoping it would give her the inspired mood, but it didn't. So I'm just going to have her sell it because it's poor quality anyways. She's going to sell it for 70 simoleons. And I'm going to have her to come over here and work on a painting. Paint from reference, a large one. And I did do a little re renovating, just a tiny bit. But I'll show you after you know, I get this picture of what I want her to paint. So um, you can take a picture of... Hell, yeah, you can take a picture of this. Or she should take a picture of the kitchen. What's a good picture she can paint? Uh, we're just going to have her take a picture of all the electronics over here. So she's going to paint this. But like I was saying, I did a little renovation. So let me just show y'all. I mean, I didn't do much. I just, like, changed this TV stand to this black coffee table. I changed the TV because for some reason, that CCTV I was using, it was not, it would not work. For no reason, it would not work for the, like the game console. She could not play any games on the CCTV, so I just had to use one of the base game TVs so she could play games and stuff and bring her fun up. 
So I had to replace that TV. I was kind of bummed because I actually like that LG TV. But yeah. And also I had added some little candles to the table on her um, desktop. Then I had um, changed the um, color of the dining table and the chairs. And I added this little decoration right here. And then I had um, expanded the wallpaper so it go past this window. And the same with the flooring because it just looked it weird because it was halfway painted, you know? Like half of it was brick, half of the window was brick, and the other half was this towel right here. It just looked it weird and uneven, so I had to fix that up. But yeah, it is 1 a.m. and this picture, the painting is coming great so far, coming along greatly. Good start. But also, I decided to make her a club. Ooh, she thinking about art. I decided to make her a club, so we're gonna do that now. So we're gonna create a club and it's gonna be an all girls club. Oh, wrong icon right here. And I decided to call it Artsy Girls. Girls. Yes. Artsy Girls. And it's gonna be all only female, only girls can join this club. So we look for the female trait right here. So she's obviously qualifying. She's gonna be the leader, of course. And we're going to, uh, um, I actually had her to meet the characters I made, the other Sims I made. So like Jasmine, you know who that is. Jasmine and Zahira. Um, Brittany is going to join the club. Dammy, should Dammy join? I guess. That's pretty much it. Everybody else looking busted. And I'm going to have to give Dammy and Brittany a makeover most likely. But mostly Dammy. Cause she look busted and ashy. Brittany, she okay, so I'm gonna keep her the way she is. But yeah, um, the club hangout is gonna be at the Blackfish Art Center in San Michino. So this is where they're gonna gather. And I'm debating if I should like make them outfit, a club outfit, but right now I don't think we can. In the description, hmm, gifted. Girls with hella talent. I don't know, that sound corny as hell. But if you guys can like give me a suggestion on what I should actually name the club. But right now it's going to be Artsy Girl and then Gifted Girls with hella talent in the description. So we're going to create this club. Wait, no, no, the club activities. Dang, I'm rushing. We got ugh, it's so much right now. Art and music, we can... Uh, Paint, of course, that's gonna be one of them. One of the activities. We can paint. What else? View arts, of course. And I think that's it. Yeah. But yeah, we have our club, Gifted Girls. And you can hurry up. We're gonna most likely in the next episode have our first club gathering. But she is tired. She is going through hell right now. So you need to hurry up and finish this painting. Oh, and she inspired too, and she's finished. It's a little poor, poor quality, but that's because her um skill. Look, let me turn off autonomy, because I'm getting tired of this hell for doing whatever she wants. Disable autonomy. I had it on because I was just playing around. I wanted to do whatever. But it's normal quality. She can do better than that. She can sell it for 147 But I mean... Yeah, we can just sell it. Because I want her to make a perfect, excellent quality before I end up hanging it on the wall. Speaking of hanging on the wall, you can go to the bathroom. This painting right here was a painting she made, and I had her to take a picture of it from her phone. You know, be a little bougie. And then I had her sell the extra painting for some money because we needed that money. But we, right now, we got $692. But right now, I'm going to have her to. Uh... Where's the quick mail? Uh, I'm supposed to click on the oven. Then, well, it's not showing up. Well, we're just gonna cook. I was looking for the serve or have a meal, dinner, or breakfast. But we're gonna have her to have, it has to be vegetarian safe. But we're gonna have her make ve vegetable dumplings because why not? Because you know she's a vegetarian. Also, I meant to say, I actually changed some of her, um, 
traits in her aspiration actually i had changed her aspiration i think to world famous celebrity sim because i want her to become famous from actually doing what she loves and that's obviously art so that being said ashley might change her career she might have to quit this medical career because one i was having just a lot of problems with it and i was just not feeling it i know i said she want i want her to pursue in a doctor career but I'm just not feeling it. No, that's the same thing happened with the free play version. She just couldn't get into it. So I'm just might have her become the artist. Cause you know, with the whole freelance career, the artists have this more advanced career that you know she can pretty much do at home. So I might have her do that once I update my game. So I still haven't updated my game. Cause like I said, a lot of mods still broken that I need in my game. But um, back to the traits. I had changed her traits over here to she still have the art lover and vegetarian and pretty much you know i had changed one of them to self-assured so now she's self-assured because you know she's her own boss she's a boss as b-i-t-c-h she a baddie you know she do whatever she want you know so she's self-assured and these traits right here caregiver and hero came with wicked whims that just randomly Automatic generate, so I couldn't pick that. It picked itself basically. But she's gonna eat, and like I said, in the morning, also while I'm at it, I need to have her to call off work because I do not want her to go to work tomorrow. Take a vacation day because I want her to do some things. Cause So the plans are she's gonna go visit her parents, you know, get their relationship up, you know, check on them. Now I'm going to have them go bowling with her parents and some of her friends. So they're going to go bowling in the um, bowling alley in Strangerville. I don't know why I just lagged just there. But yeah, she need to hurry up. Hurry up. That's our plans for today. And we just made the club. So we might actually have our first club gathering today in this episode. I don't know. And it might be some more activities I'm going to add because... Painting and just viewing art, that's a little just too basic. But, I mean, that's the whole point of the club is to have them do a lot of paintings, get their painting skills up, you know. Because eventually, I'm actually going to have her, I had decided what I'm going to do over here. I'm going to have her re open up a retail store, and she's going to open up her own art gallery, you know. And that from there, she's going to be selling all her paintings. But in order to do that, to sell, we have to have better skills the better the skills the better the quality of the painting because you know quality over quantity or some say the other way around but i say quality over quantity so yeah she's gonna be selling her paintings but you can come go to sleep now because we gotta wake up in the morning feeling like p diddy i'm just playing we're gonna wake up in the morning and go to starbucks so we're gonna have to go to sleep and then i might skip this i don't know but she's just gonna go to sleep and we're going to go to Starbucks in the morning, basically. So, yeah. I'll get back with you guys when she wake the hell up. Deuces. Okay, guys. So, I'm back. And it's currently morning time now. So, Katrina Haroka, she got ready. And so, look at look at her. Like, yes, ma'am. Look at this fit. This is her outfit for the day. And surprisingly, this whole fit is actually base game it's not cc not even base game but it um came with the boots are from cats and dog skirt is from get together i believe and the top is from get famous but the hair is cc so yeah see she speaks simlish made this hair so you guys should definitely check out her tumblr she makes some good ass cc and a whole lot of other people who i eventually will put their names in the description below you guys go check out their tumblers or whatever and get their custom content but um i had down not download i had bought this mirror because why not we need that one mirror so she could take a lot of little selfies and look books outfits of the days and stuff in the mirror and that kind of made us broke we had over 600 dollars. now we have over 200 almost 300 so it was quite pricey but anywho let's go ahead and get her to stop posing she didn't go to the bathroom right quick before we go to Starbucks, even though we can use the bathroom at Starbucks. But right now, take advantage and go ahead and do it now. And we're going to, um, where is the option? Put in inventory. 
I want her to put her com her laptop in her inventory. Then we can head on out. So let's go. Let's get this laptop and let's head out to Starbucks. Like this walk is a yes for me. Yes, ma'am. You ain't had to sit down and just put in your inventory, but go off, honey. Go all the way to hell off. So let's go to Starbucks. And like I said, it's right there across the street from her place. So just hurry up and load. And I'm also drinking water, so you know, clear my voice up a little. Why is it taking so damn long, long to load up? Come on. You wasn't doing all of this loading before I started recording. Stop playing with me, sir. <sighs> Lord. Like, it really don't need to take you this long. So I want to punch this computer so bad. Okay, thank you. Damn. So Starbucks is right here across the street. See, like I said, it has fast internet. So she'll be able to do her writing skills faster here. We're going by ourselves. So, yeah. I'm going to get back with y'all when it's loaded up because it might take a little while. But, yeah, I'll get back with y'all in a little bit. Hey guys, so here we are at Starbucks and you know, Katrina drinking her little cafe latte and she got her laptop. And so now we're going to start working on our writing skill. So practice writing. Like, yes, look at, look at this. Multitasking at its finest. Girl, you're killing it. Sickening. Yes. Oh, and also I want to show you guys the Starbucks. Um, I actually got this off the gallery. Um, I'll show who um, made it. I'll post a picture on the screen. But look how detailed this is. Like, look at this, Starbucks. Like, they even got the menu. They got the menu. Like, how realistic is that? And they got the little other seatings over here. The bathrooms right here. Like... This is a whole mood. People are just ordering coffee, cakes, and everything. Like, this is just a whole mood. And she's just out here just chilling, drinking her little latte, and on her computer. Like, and it's raining. That's even a bigger mood. Like, look at this. This view. I'm here for it. I am here for it. So, also, while she's doing that, and it looks like she's done with her coffee. So, I'm actually going to have her... To know, uh, where is it? Dang, we can't, you can't check in at Starbucks on on Instagram. No. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna um call her um dad, tell them, or her mom. We're gonna tell them that you'll be there soon, cause we're gonna go visit them. So go ahead and call your mom. Go hurry up, call TT. You ain't had to get your ass up to call her, sir. <laughs> go and let her know that we'll be over there shortly. Cause you know we just had to come here. It actually I did not plan it to be raining. It would have been better if it wasn't raining, but still it's still cute. It would have been best if like the sun was out, then that would have been even a better vibe on her, her laptop. But yeah, we're just going to um, practice writing some more. Then we're going to put her... I just told you to do something. Practice writing. What the hell is wrong with you? Man, sometimes... I don't know why Sims does that. Like Sometimes you just have to tell them to sit down before they can actually use their computers. It's dumb. Like, I don't know if that's like a bug, a glitch or, what, or something, but I hate it. Also, she's hungry still because that coffee filled her up a little. Who drink is this? Perfect pre-work shot. 
Should we steal it? No, nah, we ain't gonna steal it. We're gonna order some food. We're gonna order something. Hmm. For her to go. We're gonna order something to go. But first, let's put her um laptop up. Put that in her inventory. Then we're gonna order. Come on now. Order some food to go. We're gonna take us um vegetarian safe. Is it all vegetarian safe? It looks like it. The most expensive is the cannoli. So we're gonna go order us a little cannoli and we're gonna be off to our parents' house. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Got the last subsection. Gotta try this again. Oh, dang. This just messed up, I hope. She can't even order nothing, cut like, something just stopped. Is she gonna, the new worker? Okay, here we go. Something just stopped him from completely doing the task. I told him to make her something. He just stopped and just all these last exceptions just popped up. But it looks like she's gonna make our cannoli. Yep, the girl. Yep, I'll get back with you guys when, you know, we head off to Katrina's parents' house over there in Strangerville. So, yeah, I'll be right back until she finished making this. Okay, guys, so we're back. And Katrina has made it to her parents' house. And oh my gosh, look at the house. They got money. Girl, they got money. Fun fact, um, I actually built this house. So let me stop acting surprised. But yeah, I had built this house. And it took me, I actually built this under within a day. So yeah, this is their house here in Strangerville. I thought it looks just it just looks perfect here. Okay, so we're just gonna have Katrina come knock on the door. Go ahead, go knock on the door. Now, boy, stop calling us. I don't know you like that. Knock on the door, and we may enter their home abode. And look at their house. Like, yes, I thought I did a good job with this house. It's very modern. Just give me eyes, guys. A little quick little tour. This is everything I done to their house. It's perfect. It suits them. But um, here go her dad, Chris. He's just over here on the computer. So let's go ahead and give him a hug. Where's the hug option? Here you go. Hug lovingly. Go give your dad a hug. So you know, he'll know how much you miss them. Like, oh, Chris, look at her dad. Well, look at him. Like, mm. I see where Katrina get her looks from. It shows. This is her dad, Chris. He just looks so good. Looking just like her damn daddy. Give him a hug. And then come over here and give your mama TT a hug. She is just... She is such a beautiful chocolate lady. Look at this chocolate queen. Y'all can't tell me she don't look good. If you say she don't look good, you're a hater, period. Oh, she got a good reputation. We're introducing herself to new Sims. Katrina has a chance to start relationship off with a higher amount of friendship as her reputation now precedes her. That's cute. I just told you to give your mama a hug. Is that what you're about to do? You better. God just told you to. Yep, get her a hug. Okay, so right now we're just gonna have her to sit down. We're gonna have them sit and chat. And while they're talking, she's gonna eat her little cannoli that she got from Starbucks. So don't go ahead and eat that, boo. Why the hell would you get up if you was already sit? And then you go sit back, okay. As long as you eat your damn food. Because we ain't pay no $7 for nothing. So you're just going to sit here and chat with your mama. She don't listen to music. Uh, express overly considerate. you going to stop eating your food, TT, just to talk to your daughter. That's cool, I guess. 
tell engaging story. Just you know, catch up. You know, how was how was your day, mom? How's everything? We gonna gossip a little. I think dad is trying to grow all, grow out his chest hair. It shows through that button up shirt he was wearing. It looks disgusting. Yuck. And then discuss food flavor. This cannoli is A1. Hmm, where you get the dang cannoli from? I got it from Starbucks, mom. I literally just sat that. But you really gonna let this food go to waste, TT? Like, that look good. And you just gonna let that good food go to waste. Where's Chris? You need to come over here and chat with your damn family. Oh, he was in the little garage. You know, they got money. And they got these... Ferraris, Lamborghinis, yeah, they balling. You know, Chris had to come out, check out his cars, show oh, off. He's well, trying to show out to y'all. <laughs> Too bad they're not functional because we don't have actual cars in Sims 4 yet. Hopefully we will get it eventually because that's something I always want to in Sims 4. I mean, some people will say it's useless because, you know, we got loading screens now and Sims 3 had open world, so cars was really... A good choice to have in Sims 3 than with Sims 2. Because Sims 2 also has loading screens, but we had cars in Sims 2. So I don't see the problem with having cars in Sims 4 since we still have loading screens. So I really don't see the problem. Okay, she done with her cannoli. Going to clean up the mess. Don't be making no mess. Leaving the mess for your parents to clean. You're grown. You should be cleaning up after yourself. Let's go ahead and put that in the dishwasher. And then I guess we're going to head out to first use the bathroom. Like, look at them. They are so freaking, oh, like, look at her outfit. Like, she's just ready to go. She look cute with her little hey. Hi, why the hell were you just now eat? We about to get her to go. But she going upstairs to use the bathroom. I, like I said, I just love the way I had the house turned out. It took me a while to build. I'm actually becoming more confident with building. So you guys might actually see future videos of me building houses and doing house tours. If you would like to see those type of videos, let me know and I will surely do them. Like, look at this bathroom. Like, I love all the stuff in here. Like, like most of this stuff I use from the fitness stuff pack is very modern. And it's mirror. I don't know which pack this came, with, came in, but it's cute. But, yeah, we're going to go now to the bowling alley that's not too far from here you know the house is right here this is where we're at this nice ass house up here on this cliff with these other houses and the bowling alley is right down here the dust bowl so we're gonna go here with chris and tt then we're gonna bring Brittany, camilla Mm, I don't want to bring too much people here, though. I don't want to bring too much people with us. So, for sure, Chris, TT. Should we bring Camilla? Brittany. Brittany, I kind of have this on and off relationship with her. I have mixed feelings about Brittany. Because, you know, she seems fake as hell. Like, how she just left us hanging at the um lounge in the last episode. Having this random stranger, this guy come up talking to her. And she going to leave us alone talking to him? Like, nah, sis. That's Girls, that's girl code. That's friend code. You don't leave your friend alone talking to some stranger. That's like leaving your friend alone to ride home in an Uber or a Lyft by herself. Like, no man, we're not doing that. So, we're not even going to bring Brittany. I'm sorry, but sis, I, I'm quite mad at you right now. So, we're going to bring Camilla and Jasmine, for sure. Jasmine, you know. And, yeah. Should we bring, yeah, we're going to bring her sister, Kaylani, and her mom, Zahira. Where your dad? Oh, right here. Um, this is the guy from last episode. This is the guy who, you know, Katrina hooked up with. Um, we might, we, we had hooked up with him in the last episode. We might, um, build a relationship up with him. We, I don't know. You guys let us know. But, yeah, that's everybody. So, we're just going to leave him out. So, this is everybody going with us to the Oasis Spring Dust Bowl. And I'll get back with you guys when we're here. Okay, guys, so here we are at the bowling alley with the friends and family. We had Katrina over here just talking to everyone. Ooh. And this is the um, bowling alley. Got a little bar over there. And this is all of the bowling, bowling lanes. Ooh, who that? 
He cute. Let's see what he got. Oh, he oh he don't know how to act because he know how to bowl. Anyways. Oh, look at Jasmine, Kaylani hugging. Sisterly, sisterly love. Okay, so we need to get everybody to... Can we do something with... Okay. So like a bowling ball. We need to get a bowling ball. Clear, racial bowling. Oh, so we got to get this one. So we got to get the sky blue one. And so we're just going to start bowling. Invite to bowl. Invite to a bowl at three. Um, I don't know what the, I don't know what the difference is, but um, basically we're just going to have GG. Um, what the hell Chris said? Did he leave? I think Chris left us. Damn. That's cold. So we're going to play with Kehlani and Jasmine and TT. Let's see how this goes. Oh, they got someone from the military. I forgot we was in Strangerville for a second because the name of the bowling alley is Oasis Spring, Dose of Dust Bowl. This is supposed to be in Oasis Spring, but I decided to put in Strangerville because I didn't have no more room. But um, yeah, that's a military person. Trina just acquired her bowling skill. Bowling, a game of skill for children and adults alike. Reading a book isn't going to help you here. You need to play. Play again and then keep on playing. If you want to rise through the ranks, as Katrina improves her skill, she'll improve her form and score. She'll also unlock a new bowling ball colors as she goes. Dang, she got a strike. As she goes, which can be selected from the bowling ball rack, which we just did. Keep the dream of a perfect llama game. What's up with all these llamas in Sims 4? Game of all strikes alive with high skills and a bit of luck. Katrina is sure to get there. I'm sure she is, cause she literally just got a strike. Uh, girl, how the hell you just dropped the ball like that? That's embarrassing. Really embarrassing. Where, where is, is there go Chris right there? Where is y'all going? Is he finna go? He he left for us. And this help for Judith, Judith Ward. She stay pregnant in my game. I don't understand. Dang. So they're like, everybody just left for us. Hold up. Nah, sir. So. They did leave us. Why everybody just left us hanging? Y'all, you know what? We gonna play again. We just gonna play by ourselves. And I'm, I just can't get over this fit. Ugh, damn shoes make her look ugly. Damn shoes just made her whole outfit look ugly as hell. But she she killing it. I mean, you didn't get a strike that time, but you still still doing good. Yeah, she look confident, feeling herself. This whole outfit, though, y'all, I just can't. I'm trying to get some screenshots of her playing bowling, though. And after that, after that she's going to get her a drink because, you know, she a little, she a little pissed right now. She a little pissed, pissed because they left her here alone, playing bowling alone. Let me get some pictures. It's just stupid, man. It just, that just pissed me off. How the hell, I invited y'all out to have some fun, spend time with y'all. Y'all just gonna leave her. I ain't, I ain't tripping. I'm just trying to get some screenshots before, you know, we head out. That was the plan, but it's not gonna work since, you know, they done left her alone. Uh -huh. So who's gonna come over here and get us a little drink? Okay. Order a drink. Order a drink for us. We're gonna get the most expensive. Not even expensive, cause we gotta be careful, cause we ain't got that much money like that now. We're gonna get us a Bridgeport. Bridgeport, that's the name of that, um, that city from Sims 3. I think it came with, um, what was it, Showtime? So late night, whatever. That's the name of that city, Bridgeport. 
go and get you some damn Bridgeport alcohol. So I was going to sit down. I should have sworn. I, did I not just tell her to sit down? I guess I didn't because these mother truckers just took her spot. Go ahead and hurry up and make her drink. She didn't take it that long. I don't know what you wearing, but go off. Do you, boo? I hate that. See, that's another thing I hate with these townies. They always be randomly wearing anything. And it's just... Ugh. And I do, I do not feel like giving everyone a makeover. Damn, she all the way over here. Just drinking. Oh, oh there go the last exception. Man. What are y'all watching? What is y'all watching? I guess she can watch it too. Yeah, she just feeling her so that alcohol got her a little focus. You know what? We're gonna go home. We're going to invite someone over to our house. And I'm gonna see. Invite. No, actually we're gonna travel with someone. That's how we're gonna do it. So we're gonna go back home because these people just left us stranded, stranded in this damn bowling alley. So we're gonna go back home. Actually, no, we're going to go, where is it? We're gonna go to the art museum. So, she, you know, because I want her to, like, like I said, I want her to focus on her, not only her writing skill, but her painting skill. So, when she, if she goes to the art museum, she can, like, go and, like, get inspired, basically, from all the other artwork that she sees. So, we can go to the art gallery and then go by ourselves. Just by ourselves, because, you know, these fake-ass friends and family done left us. So it was good to do a little bowling, but I'll get back with y'all when we get there.